Question number one. When using a hand electric mixer and the cake batter creeps up the stem, what's this phenomenon called? It's called the Weisenberg Phenomenon. That's correct! That was a scene from last year's quiz game that aired on Motostar TV. Will the quiz event be as exciting as last year, folks? We're looking for new entrants. Sign up now. Wow, already that time of year, huh? I'm Motoki Umei, 22 years old. Okay, on to the next question. What's the name of that little plastic faster you find on bags for bread sold at the supermarket? That would be bag closure. Good job, Mizuho. Boy, you're just like us. Ultra smart. As I sat there daydreaming, my folks were throwing questions at my sister, Mizuho. Yeah, well, these questions are pretty easy. At least for me. Yeah, well, we brought you up right. We're so proud of you, Mizuho. Unlike our younger daughter, her brother Motoki is not at all bright and has no future ahead of him. I can't believe they're related. My little sister went to all the best schools and was at the top of her class. She entered many quiz events and won awards, getting showered with praise by my folks. No use thinking about Motoki. Let's put all our efforts into Mizuho's potential. What's most important in a quiz game is how fast you can press the button. Yeah, that's right. Okay, we're gonna do some button pressing exercises. My folks would hold the button, much like what's used in these games. Mizuho would practice pressing it as fast as she could. Way too slow! You have to focus and speed things up! Yeah, right! Too slow! You keep this up and you'll lose before you even started! You got it, Dad! They just practiced this over and over again. As a result, I was hearing this ding-dong racket over and over again. It was driving me nuts. Man, getting on my nerves. I think they better work on answering the questions. Huh? You just say something, Motoki. You have no idea how hard these quizzes are. Oh, crap. They heard me. I've got to be careful. You're a bad influence on Mizuho. You're not a college student anymore. Maybe you should live on your own. Yeah, that's a great idea. That way we can focus 100% on training Mizuho. Okay, Motoki. Pack your things, buddy. Just like that, I was suddenly kicked out of my own home. After my brother left, I continued studying, but overall nothing changed. I got to do more. Uh, study more if I'm gonna win. My parents are looking forward to me winning the coming quiz event. I've been getting good grades all throughout school, and they figure I'd breeze through the quiz. Yeah, Mizuho is in the top of her class. She'll have no trouble acing those questions. No doubt about it. She'll breeze through it and win the top prize. Recently, we've been practicing in preparation for the event on Motostar TV. My folks have been entering me in various local quiz events in a warm-up for the big event. Yes, right. I'll give it my best. Boy, everyone looks like they're used to these quizzes. Can I really win in this kind of environment? And if I can't win, then what? What happens to me? Recently, I started feeling the pressure of these quizzes and anxiety over how my parents would react. Hmm, second place win again, huh? I was on the verge of winning the top prize, but lost at the final question. We worked hard so you could win, and this is the result? Maybe you're just like Motoki. This is quite a disappointment, Mizuho. I'm really sorry. There was only two weeks left before the National High School Quiz Tournament. That high school quiz tournament is coming up soon. Uh, yeah, right. You do realize your father and I have given you all the support we can so you can win this, right? Uh, yeah, I know. I really didn't know how to reply to them. They were so sure of me winning. I already told all the neighbors that she will definitely win this thing. That's easy as pie for my super smart daughter. 
You lose this and we will be so ashamed we won't even be able to walk outside. Oh boy, I get pressure like that and I'll get even more nervous. I wish they would stop. Well, don't worry. I've thought of plan B if things go sour. Huh? With that, my mom showed me a photo of some guy I'd never seen before. Huh? Who's this? What's this about? If you don't win the next big national quiz championship, you're gonna have to marry this guy. Huh? Seriously? If you have no brains, what's the use? Just getting married is your only option. It's easy. Just win and all is fine. You're kidding me, right? Oh my god. I really have to win this no matter what. What do I do? I was weighed down by all this. Please, please answer if you're there. If I don't do something, they're gonna marry me off to some guy. I was trying to contact the National High School Quiz Association. I sent off the mail to the person in charge. Yes, I got a reply. No, no. Does that mean I just have to marry that guy? Sometime after moving out, I was working at home when I got a message on my work address. I was confused by this strange message, but then... Hey, this address looks familiar. I'd seen that address somewhere before. This message is from Mizuho. Figures, my folks would do something like that. I felt sympathy for my kid sister. I sent her a reply saying we couldn't do such a thing, but I decided to add something else. Although we cannot reveal the questions, we can teach you the skills to win. Really? Thank you, that would be so helpful! After that, I provided Mizuho with similar questions that would likely appear in the quiz event. We repeated this type of questioning, doing it over and over. Hey everyone, Masa here with Yakobi. Welcome to my channel! Hey everyone, Yakobi here. Today, we're here to cover the Motostar TV Super Quiz Event! I'm Masa Sanada. Although I'm still in high school, I have 2 million followers on my MoneyTube channel. I'm here with my classmate Yakobi to do an episode on the National High School Quiz Tournament and enter as contestants too. Christ, I thought he was kidding about us entering this contest, but I guess he went ahead and actually did it. I've been practicing for the last three months for this very day! I cannot lose! I'm invincible! Is he serious? Okay, not a bad opening intro. Hey Yakubi, we're really here at the national event, huh? Man, we're actually gonna be famous when we get on Motostar TV! This is awesome! Okay ladies and gentlemen, please let me explain the rules of regulations concerning this quiz event. Please move over to the stage area. Thank you all for coming today! My name is Nico, an official maid at Motoboshi Industries, and I'll be acting as your MC today! I will read out the questions, and once you get the answer, please go up to the center of the stage and give your answer. If you answer correctly, I will hand you one of these badges. Once you get three of these, you've passed the first stage! Are you ready? Here's the first question! The first person to answer was... That's so easy! Memorial Day! That's correct! You were awarded one badge! And after that, this girl musical answered right away. She was able to answer each question with tremendous speed and reach the next stage. Wow! He's awesome! We can't be sitting on our butts! Yeah, let's do this! After the awesome performance by Mizuho, the next that reached the next stage was none other than Masa. Gradually, people went on to the next step and many dropped out. Hmm, I've heard that before. Uh, Tabasco? That's correct! The three correct. Congratulations on going on to the next stage! Okay. That's all the entrants that made it into the next stage. Man, I didn't expect to get this far. Oh well. Oh man, I didn't make it this year. Darn it! 
Mr. Yakubi, we didn't make it, but please do this for us too! Huh? Uh, right. Okay. Now we have 16 players that made it through to the top. They will battle it out for the win! We're now headed for the long-anticipated final battle! The only contestants left are Masa and Mizuho! Mizuho, you did well, beating out all your rivals! We've finally come to the final question. You're now 20 versus 20. This last question will determine the winner. Are you ready for the final question? <clears throat> what are copies that depict things that either had no original or no longer have an original? Miss Mizuho has the initiative. We call that Simulacra. Yes, that's correct! I did it! I really did it! Oh my god, I don't believe this! If I had pressed the button a little sooner, I could have won! I worked really hard at it, and as a result, I was able to win in the end! Wow, I'm so relieved! We'd now like to interview Miss Mizuho! Congratulations! You did it! How do you feel? I feel great! I can't believe I really did it! I was under tremendous pressure and I almost gave up, but I told myself that I had to stay strong till the end. And with the help of a certain person, I was able to gain confidence and get through this and win! Are you saying that your parents played a major role in your victory? Actually, we have Miss Mizuho's parents in the audience! We'd like to invite them up here and have them say a few words about their daughter's win. Huh? Oh, you guys were here? Hello, everyone. Yes, that's me. I'm Mizuho's father, Sadaki. And I'm her mom, Akina. Yes, it was us who gave her the proper training to win this tournament. We were responsible for drawing out her true potential. Yes, it was because of our hard work that allowed Mizuho to flourish. They went on and on about how they and they alone contributed to my success. We always believed in her. We knew she was special, and when she was under pressure, we supported her. We nurtured the undeniable potential that we knew was there. Yes, that's right. If it wasn't for us, she would never have achieved this victory. The three of us were a team. The unbreakable bond between us got us through. I couldn't stand it any longer. I had to say something. I'm sorry, but none of what they said is true. My parents didn't care the least about me. They wanted me to enter this tournament for their own selfish reasons. Wait, Mizuho, what are you saying? Yes, what do you mean by that? I went on to tell them all about how they manipulated me and made me enter the event. What's more, if I didn't win this tournament, I was set to marry some guy I'd never met before. Uh, I think Mizuho is a little tired after all that pressure. She doesn't know what she's saying. Uh, yeah, yes, Mizuho. Are you okay? Maybe we should go home, huh? I ignored them and continued to tell the audience about what really went on. I was so desperate that I even called the organizers of this tournament and pleaded with them to give me the answers in advance. But that person, of course, denied such a request. Instead, he sent me some practice questions and helped me prepare for this. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be standing here before you. But he never revealed who he was. Actually, I don't even know if it was a he. Is she serious? Is that even fair? I'm so very grateful for your help. I'm indebted to you! What she's saying is a complete lie. She's making it all up. That's right, it's all in her head. Uh, excuse me, but... The crowd started talking among themselves, not believing what just took place. Even the MC Nico was speechless. What Mizuho just said is all true. Motoki, what the hell are you doing here? Why are you even here? Please don't make matters worse by saying something stupid. Uh, Motoki? I know my little sister was under tremendous pressure and that she tried hard to get this win. She was so distraught that she wrote to the organizers of this event. But, Motoki, why do you even know this? 
Well, that's because I create all the questions for the quiz tournament. That's why. What? You can't be serious. Yeah, you. A guy with no real education. How could you make the questions? My job is a quiz creator. I do this for a living. So does that mean it was you who was training me all this time? I would like to assure everyone that I did not provide Mizuho with one question that would come up in the tournament. I knew that my kid's sister was a genius when it came to doing these quizzes. I knew that once she gained confidence, I knew she would be able to stand on the stage today. And she did just that! Motoki! So it was my brother that supported me all this time! He's the one who really believed in me! And about you guys, Mom, Dad, we just have to ask the neighbors and our relatives about this. They know all about how you treated Mizuho. This whole thing is being aired. Thousands of people are seeing this. No, no. This is not happening. Stop the cameras now! With that, my parents were revealed for what they really are for all the world to see. And were shamed into silence. Man, what kind of parents are they? Yeah, making her marry some strangers. Who does that? Trying to take credit for her win? Like it was all their hard work? Oh, how awful. Apparently, that embarrassing incident really got to them, and they weren't as cocky as they once were. And as for Mizuho... We're now living together at my place. What is the actual name of this item? That's called a lunch charm. We don't see them around much anymore, so young people probably never even seen one. Oh yeah, I didn't realize that. Wow, so there are things that my brother doesn't know. <laughs> Hey, Masa. He must be pretty disappointed that you lost that tournament. Yeah, I bet he's pretty down about it. Masa's pretty chill. He can handle this kind of disappointment. See? Good morning, gents. The tournament yesterday was a blast, wasn't it? Too bad about the loss yesterday, Masa. <laughs> yeah, I was getting to that. Check this out, man. I got all kinds of positive responses from that little tournament. <laughs> this is great, guys. See what I mean? He's really chill. <laughs> you gotta give it to the popular money tuber like me, right? If I really put my mind to it, I can do just about anything. Yeah, yeah right. right. Oh yeah, if you have a similar experience at some quiz game like this, let's hear it into the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here. We'd love to hear your thoughts too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon!